Black Sci-Dye Tech. In this video, I'm going to go do a teardown of this GPS device. I'm curious to see what's inside, see how it works, and see if there's any useful components worth salvaging. Let's get started. So, as you can see, there are some screws, and these ones use special screws, which is the XT6 screws. So I'm going to go ahead and remove those. Next, what I need to do is pry out the corners to allow the GPS device to slip out. And there, it pops out carefully without tearing the ribbon cable. And as you can see, the ribbon cable is attached right here. And there, it is now removed. Pull out the microphone. And there, it is now removed. Next, take a screwdriver and basically see a screw, take a screw, see a screw, take a screw, and remove the entire circuit out of the housing. And there, I have right here a little speaker. Now that I can probably use because I like little speakers like these. Continue removing the hex screws, and there, the speaker comes out. Ah, as you can see, this is a very nice speaker. Definitely can use this for a future project. And now over the rest of the components that's on this board, there's a lithium battery. Feeling the battery, it didn't get hot, so I didn't damage it, so that's a good thing. And if I can't get this battery to work, I can just simply extract the lithium inside and do some experiments with that. Now the circuit looks very interesting. There are some surface mount components that are worth salvaging. Like some of these capacitors and some diodes. The audio jack connectors look very nice to extract. Remove this little copper cooling pad. Interesting components, some of which may be worth salvaging. These connector pins right here may contain gold, so I can probably salvage this circuit for precious metals. Next, what I need to do is remove the LCD from this housing. As you can see, it's still attached. Pry off the sides carefully. Remove the microphone. And there, now I have the LCD. This LCD can be useful for wearable devices, maybe some kind of watch or gamepad, or I can wear it on my wrist, and since it has a touchscreen, I might be able to use it to control something, or something really creative I can do. Maybe attach this battery to it, if, if the battery works, and of course, attach a speaker to this device, and I can probably turn it into some little portable gaming console. Possibly. Not really sure, but I can do something interesting. And as you can see, these are the three components that are worth salvaging. This touchscreen LCD, this battery, and the speaker. And there you have it. Now you know what's inside of a common GPS device and what kind of components that are worth salvaging. Thank you for watching SciTech Tech. I hope you learned something new. And don't forget to like and subscribe and of course click on the bell icon to be notified of future SciTech Tech videos. Till the next tech. Goodbye.